The objective of the hanging self paint line is to hang parts on a paint line. The equipment used during this process is the overhead monorail, cart, pedestal for bin of hooks, and the racks. The materials used during this process are the hooks and parts. This photo depicts the hanging self paint line station and the dimensions of the workspace. Considering the worker height ranges from 5 feet 7 inches to 6 feet 2 inches or 67 to 74 inches tall, this affects how the employees interact with the product and equipment throughout the day. The process for the hanging self paint line is to retrieve a handful of hooks or a rack and then position the hooks or rack in the eye of the monorail. Then the part is retrieved and positioned on the hook. It is noted that work is done in batches as in one worker will hang the hooks and others will hang parts or one worker will hang several hooks and then will hang several parts. It was noticed that awkward postures and forceful exertions were observed from the employees to interact with the workspace. Forceful exertions are required to carry the rack and parts. Forceful exertions are required to hang the parts while backward bending of the neck and elevated arms is seen to hang the disc. Backward bending of the neck and elevated arms are also seen to hang the part and the hook. To summarize this process, the hanging self paint line station is a medium paced job requiring forceful exertions to retrieve, carry, and hang parts. In addition, awkward postures of the neck and arms are seen and localized contact stress between the hands and edges of the parts were observed as well. The following recommendations are made for the hanging self paint line tasks. Investigate methods and mechanisms for lowering selected areas of the monorail for positioning hooks to reduce posture stress. Monitor the wheels on the carts and maintain and replace the wheels as needed to reduce forceful exertions. Monitor and maintain the floor surface so that the carts glide easily to reduce forceful exertions. Consider worker rotation plans to reduce exposure to awkward postures. Thank you.